Hey YouTube, that was an ugly wave, but hey YouTube, this is a unique superstar coming to you guys with another video. And right now I'm just chilling with my my onesie from topman.com and I just felt the need to make this video because I was on Yahoo, right? And I saw Bethany Moda, you know, the YouTuber Bethany Moda saying like how successful her YouTube empire is and things like that. And so basically in the article it was talking about how it all started off in her northern California bedroom and she was just making videos. And I was talking about, you know, how she has her own clothing line at Air Postal and stuff like that. And it says that her YouTube channel has generated an estimated of $40,000 per month because she has what does it say she's had over 300 million views since her channel has launched right so forty thousand dollars a month that's I calculated that and I believe that was let me just make sure you guys that is oops that is four hundred and eighty thousand dollars per year okay so clearly she's doing well for herself that's all fine and dandy but where i have the problem is it's like yeah she does do giveaways sometimes but honestly if i made that much money just off of youtube and my other endeavors i would feel the need to give back constantly to my subscribers and my viewers and supporters because if it weren't for any of you if it weren't for us the people that support you people that watch your videos people that buy your clothing line at airpods you'd have nothing you would have nothing and I feel like a lot of times youtubers are always just greedy and fake and ungrateful for what they have like they very seldomly like a lot of youtubers very seldomly do giveaways and you know when they do do giveaways I can't admit that they are very nice giveaways but honestly I will be doing the giveaway at least once a week if I made that much per year because like I said you have to give to those who go without or have without you have to spread your blessings because what's the point of being blessed when you can't bless other people that's kind of one reason why we are here on this earth to you know it's good to be successful and you know that's the ultimate goal right but you know you also need to spread your success spread your wealth and you know share your talents and things like that and I feel as though like I said if you're making four hundred and eighty thousand dollars a year you need to be giving back a lot more not saying like I don't know clearly she probably does donate to charity and things like that but um, she should give back in different ways and um, via different avenues you know and YouTube um, should be and you know YouTube Instagram Twitter and things like that those should be like some of her biggest avenues of giving back um, as well as giving back to charity and things like that but I don't know um, and she's not the only youtuber so I'm just not singling out her there are other youtubers that are you know you know have make a large income off of YouTube and other endeavors and they just simply don't give back and it just really disheartens me because if that was me I really would give back to you guys because you know I would greatly appreciate it because I know I would be nothing without you guys you know literally I'd be nobody I would have nothing I would I wouldn't have you know the salary that I have or whatever the case may be so I just feel like youtubers need to um, keep in mind that they how fortunate they are just keep in mind how fortunate and blessed that they are and just give back they need to stop being all you know um selfish i guess you could say it's just stop being selfish and you know give back um and really genuinely appreciate and thank your supporters i don't like the word fans and the reason why i don't like the word fans is because it makes it seem um like kind of like oh like not as personal I like the word supporters because that that is what a fan is if that makes sense um supporters are people that support you and whatever you do the word fans it just to me is not as um positively descriptive as the word supporters that's just my viewpoint and opinion but um, yeah, like I said, I just feel as though YouTubers and people in general, everybody in this world needs to give back um, to less fortunate people. And 
be grateful forever grateful for what they have and um yeah like i said she's not the only youtuber i just wanted to make this video because i saw you know this on the yahoo page and things like that but there are other youtubers you know like dulce candy and um just a lot of other youtubers like i don't want to really name a lot of names but like i said i just want to make this video but um share this with um you know all of the YouTubers that you know that are successful on YouTube. So maybe because this could actually, you know, open up someone's eyes because sometimes people don't know what they're doing or the lack of their doing. So just, you know, share this with some um, well-known popular YouTubers so this can, so they can view this video and kind of realize if they haven't, you know, their lack of giving back to the people that have given them so much. Um, so thank you guys so much for watching and like I said definitely share this video with other youtubers share this on your Instagram you can take a picture of this video you know pause and take a picture and put on your Instagram tweet out this video whatever you want to do on all your social media I just want to say thank you and always be grateful always be thankful and live life for yourself and nobody else and not in a selfish kind of way. When I say live life for yourself and nobody else, that basically means do what you want to do and follow your dreams, basically. But like I said, don't forget to give back and don't forget where you came from because, you know, you can definitely stray away and, you know, have problems and things like that. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And don't forget to share, like, comment, and subscribe. In the meantime, be a superstar. Peace.